Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Michael Wambua. Uh, today I'm going to take you through a very short video on walls. We're going to discuss how to draw a wall, how to draw a slanted wall, how to draw curved walls, and also how to adjust some wall settings. So let's get started. So to get started, a wall is a design tool and it's found here. So here is the wall, wall tool. You can also find, find the wall tool under design. Um, so design architectural tools, we have it there. Okay, so what do we do? Uh, we can just choose to tap on one point then uh, move along the line. So now we are drawing a wall. As we draw the wall, you can see we have the distance and we have the angle. So, okay. So here is our wall. So this is just a straight wall. And as you have seen, we are using the geometry method, the straight, this one. So to adjust, to, to have a different geometry method, you can just decide to choose. So let's choose... Um, so this one is uh, chained, then we have rectangular, yeah, so we can choose the chained one. So when we have the chained, it's very easy. You just come and you hit the point, you hit another point. You can draw uh, as, as, as many, as many uh, faces as you want. So for example that okay so it looks like that then we have we have others we have this uh, this is curved then we have a trapezoid so our main focus today is just how to draw a wall and if you are a beginner to draw a wall is you, you just draw the basic wall now you just use uh, the basic the straight or the chain to make your work easier but if you're drawing a rectangular you can just choose a this method this one would work for you you see you just have so let's just view in 3d then we can continue with what we're doing so here we have our so as you can see this this wall is uh if i just hob it a little bit you see the faces have different uh, coloration the difference is here this is a composite wall. For example, so this is where setting or having um, some basic settings will help you in. So you can just come and choose to have uh, the basic one. Then uh, the reference line, we want it to be the bit. I would advise you to have it at the center. So let's, let's now try to draw and see where is the difference between the two okay now let's view the new one so you can see there's a difference right okay so now that you have learned how to draw a wall this is a rectangular wall or a straight uh, a wall on a linear a straight uh, wall so what if you want to draw a slanted wall you come to settings, then you add just a few things. You can see here is where we have a slanted wall. You can have it slanted on one side or you can have it slanted on uh, both sides. So, um, so these are wall default settings. We have the geometry and positioning. So we can adjust the height of the wall. We can adjust the width to hit at 200 or we can um, we can also do the other things this is more floor plan and section display we, you can change that but that is not uh, that is not uh, what we want to achieve in this lesson so let's just eat a slanted wall because now we want to do so we want the wall to be slanted by, let's say, 
65, let's say 60, 60 degrees. Hit OK. So let's adjust this one to this. Okay, so let's let's see how it looks like. Okay, let's view in 3D. So as you can see, it is slanted, right? Yeah, it is slanted. As well, you can just draw a straight line like this one. Then you you choose to you, you decide to to have it slanted. You can adjust it like you, as you see. There's a slant angle. And there's the distance. So you can you can decide. So let's have a, that. So that's how you do a slanted wall. Okay. Now let's let's investigate something else. What about how to draw a curved wall? You've seen uh, we have uh, we have this one. This is curved, but it won't help you. You may not achieve much using this one, this geometry method. So let's use the spline tool. So imagine with the spline tool, it gives you a lot of confidence because you you can uh, you can draw the shape you really want. So we have that one. So imagine if you want to draw a wall that looks like that. So you just come to the wall. Uh, then you okay. The setting was for curved wall, uh, slanted. So let's let's return it to to this one. Okay. So so you hit the space button. It is called the magic wand. So you hit the space button and you hit OK. So now we have our curved wall. Let's view it. So here it's our curved wall. This is our, here is our curved. Here is our curved wall. So you can also do a curved wall that is uh, slanted. So let's backspace then then have a slant. So then we come here. You hit the magic wand again. Okay. So let's see how how it is. So we also have that. So you can achieve a lot of things with this. So thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, we have come to an end of this video. And uh, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that other videos don't, uh, so that you are alerted on new videos. Thank you very much.